step on anybody's toes. We want to work uh, hand in hand with all of you and really with the focus of the mission of Friendship Trades in mind. So if you see us doing something out of line, let us know and uh, we'll, we'll rectify it. But again, we're here to be good stewards of Friendship Trades and good kitchen. Um, it will be a business at first, you know, for us and then primarily a revenue uh, generator for, for Friendship Trades. So we're excited about it. And Looking forward to, to getting as much help as possible. And Jeff Ron has been kind enough to offer that, so we will take him up on that. Good. And hopefully, it'll also uh, provide opportunity to students and some of the other folks here that maybe are looking for additional hours and, and time and things like that to benefit everybody. Uh, you know, as we grow, the requirements and needs will start out small at first with just a few people, but then will grow as a business grows, the needs will grow. We're, what we're really planning on doing is coming in and, and uh, we've gotten some, uh, you know, folks that want on a limited basis some delivery. So we'll start out just with the two of us making food and, you know, learning the kitchen with the help of you all how the equipment works, where the storage and things like that delivery, get the process going, and then as the demand will go out and start getting people attracted to the business, try and sell the business to folks to use, and then as those needs are required, we'll get somebody in to probably do the cooking because I've been in the restaurant business for over 25 years and owned a restaurant for about 15. Uh, I don't have a culinary background to, to do all that. I've got more of the operational and overall general operating. I love to cook and can you know, cook a few things, but not on the scale of this or what you all are doing on a daily basis by any stretch. So, Will it be what, like a lunch meal that you're sending out? It'll be dinners. Oh, dinner. Mostly dinners. Like dinners. dinners. Yeah. Yeah. This is a, the, the, the premise behind it is Good Kitchen will supply or supplement families on a weekly basis, meals to really supplement their, their dining needs. So not everybody has a sit down meal every single night. You know, they'd like to, but because of schedules and Side lack practice. of time and you know, all the rest of these, these commitments that we all have as being busy people, you can't sit down and make a fresh cooked meal every night as much as you'd like to. So a lot of people are going out to dinner, going through drive throughs or, you know, eating poorly. This will be an opportunity to have a couple of meals a week delivered to them that they can basically pull out, heat up, and have good quality, you know, healthy, portion balanced, you know, controlled meals. And, um, you know, there's been a, a lot of folks who have asked for low sodium diets, folks that have wanted organic, you know, smaller portions, healthier, you know, product. Then there's also a need for comfort food. Just, you know, people want something that's going to be good for the family, quick, easy, healthy, and, you know, uh, good for, you know, mostly convenience, and that's what we're, we're providing. We're going to, we're going to alternate the menu. We're going to rotate it every two weeks. Uh, and our differentiation is that we're going to deliver these meals. I mean, if we outgrow this kitchen, those are fabulous problems to have, but I can't imagine outgrowing it unless it just gets so busy that I would, I would think it would be very simple. We know that, you know, basically from now, one or two o'clock in the afternoon or three o'clock in the afternoon on, there'll be some availability to work. Again, we can get a lot of work, uh, you know, food prepped and portioned and chilled and refrigerated, things like that. But, uh, you know, once we get a schedule down and start growing, we'll see our needs. But I wouldn't think that we would outgrow the facilities for a, a long time. And again, if we do, that's kind of good for everybody. Good. That's a good problem for everybody. It's the food that behaves, it's the people we gotta all <laughs> make sure that we all work together. The food won't have any problems, it'll just be we all gotta work together and do well by each other. Yes, right. So we're excited and thank you for letting us come in and be a part of this. And I know that kitchen space is at a premium, so for all of you to let us in is very kind. We look forward to making that, regret that.
Yeah. Well, I'm work with you. Remember, they make you feel good. Uh-uh.